All right, hey guys, it's Asha. So I am back with a reading vlog. I just bought this new camera, so I'm really getting used to it. It is like so strange the little screen i'm not used to it because i used to film on my um digital dslr is that what those cameras are called this is so strange i don't know how they don't stare at themselves when people film like this anyways so yeah i'm super excited to do this reading vlog this weekend because i have the new camera i think it's gonna make my life so much easier probably gonna buy one of those little um tripods to make it easier but yeah, I thought I'd come do a little intro because I actually need to charge it before I do anything. And yeah, this is like really nice quality. I have to say, my hair looks super frizzy, but what else is new? All right, hey guys. So last night I did not read anything, but hopefully I'll be able to read this today. I think I'm going to the pool, so I should be able to read a bunch of pages toby you're so cute I don't. yeah last night i didn't really do anything just relax and like ate pizza watched a movie and things but this is the goal for today i'm gonna stop by target because i really want some cute fall decorations so i'm gonna get ready in a minute and then we can take you guys with me to target from Michael's and then we stopped by Walmart to get stuff for the pool he got these disgusting chips mm. hot and spicy chili I like it's how I like my women too oh my god and then um, this what is it hard salami party tray this is what we always get when we go to the pool or the beach it's so good right mm-hmm and then, obviously, I'm gonna take my book and try to read like 50 pages. That's my goal. Are you taking a book? No, I'm uh, taking my flashcards. Oh yeah, because he's studying. Studying. We'll see how much studying you get. Fantasy book. Anyways. Go so Chargers! Taste test. Okay. <laughs> Are they spicy? Taste? 10 out of 10? Texture. 11 out of 10. Oh, yeah, it's, it's spicy. Really spicy? It has the hot heat. So today is Sunday and as you saw we just I was outside on my balcony reading a little bit of the dreamers and I'm on page 71 I think so I'm on chapter 12 now and I'm really enjoying it I don't think I ever said what it's about it's basically about this illness that comes to a town sorry if you can hear the TV on he's watching football right now but 
yeah so it's about this illness that starts to come to this town in california and these girls in this um college dorm room all on the same floor start to fall into this sleep and they don't wake up and they're finding out they're like having these dreams she literally just found out but i mean that's not a spoiler the book is called the dreamers so um yeah i really like it because you're starting to get a little bit different perspectives not just of call it the college girls and their family you're starting to get more into the town so i think it's really interesting um, i'm really liking it so far it's super easy to read like really quick so i plan on reading a little bit more of this today and i also need to study a little bit but yeah i'm really liking this so far it's very interesting i'm really curious where this book is gonna go because i have no idea but i'm really liking it so there's that and then i also want to show you guys some of the stuff that i picked up from target yesterday today we just went to just got back from brunch which i showed a little bit of clips of it was really nice it was on the beach and we got some mimosas it was really good and then yeah so let me show you guys what i got from target so the first thing i picked up was this yellow throw here because like i said i want to get a little bit more fall items and i want to instead of doing the pink here i want to do this mustard yellow so i got this throw to replace this blanket and i'm going to get some like pillow covers there but they didn't have any more at target so gonna have to find some but i really love this because it's like a giant sweater and it's so soft and it was on sale so it's like perfect so i can't wait to put that up and then i also bought this little tripod which i'm really excited about to vlog more hi toes you go go cat hi he's so cute <laughs> so yeah so i picked this up hi and then I got a couple of t-shirts. I think you guys saw that. So I picked this little crop top. It says the Mercury Retrograde World Tour. So that was really cute. Little crop top to wear. I love the sun and moon. Got that. And then I picked up this queen t-shirt. Which I was super excited to find. Because I've been wanting a queen um, graphic tee. So I love this. This was actually in the men's section. If you ever go to Target and you want a cute graphic tee, check out the men's section, it's way better. And then I also picked this graphic tee also in the men's section. The other one, the Mercury Retrograde was in the women's, but this is the men's one that I got. That was so cute. It says Shroot Farms, like how cute is that? All right, hey guys. So it is about, what time is it? It's like six o'clock basically and Oh, Toby's coming out of the blank. So my friend left. He randomly decided to come um, visit me Friday. It was like a spontaneous thing. So that was fun, but now he left to go back. And so now I am home alone. And I was just watching some YouTube videos and like relaxing. I'm like really tired today. But anyways, so yeah, so I think I'm going to read for a little bit for like an hour and then i will probably end the vlog there i hope this vlog was like kind of interesting so like i said i'm reading this i read like 10 pages i think last time i talked to you guys so now i'm on chapter 14. it's getting a little bit more interesting and more and more people are getting sick i'm not gonna like spoil anything but obviously like there's some kind of contagion so yeah more and more people are getting sick in this little town and i'm really curious like like i said like, where this book is going because i don't I have no idea i can't even like try to think of something that would I, I don't know i have no idea i'm gonna sit down and read for like an hour i think and then call it a night Hey guys, so it is now about 7.30 and I read a bit more of The Dreamers. I'm now on page 122, so I don't even know how many pages that is. I'm not really keeping track, but yeah, I'm really enjoying it. I'm just, like I said before, I'm trying to figure out like what the point of the book is. I really am liking it. I like that the... I like these kinds of stories. They're always super scary to me about a virus. 
um, attacking. Let's see. I'm still trying to figure out this tripod. One second. Let's see. So the like virus spreading through a story or something like that always is like this one of the scariest things to me. <laughs> so I really like this, but it's not written like extremely scary. It's more very contemporary, kind of like going kind of like through this little town. Um, but I, I'm really liking it. I'm just curious, you know, where it's going. That's the only thing I'm not really sure, but I, I'm really liking it, especially my like medical school brain is like loving the whole virus and microbio. And there's also a, a psychiatrist that they bring in because they think that it may be um, psychosomatic. So they also bring a psychiatrist in there. She's talking about that. It's really interesting. You can tell that the author did a lot of research. I never read author's notes, like really rarely will I read the author's note, but I, I think I am gonna read this because I wanna know like where she got, what kind of like um, ideas she got for this and stuff. And the characters are really interesting. Um, you just, you like slowly just kind of like meet new characters in the town. So I'm, I'm liking it. Like I, well, I don't know if I said, but I really like books like that where you just kind of, like flow along with characters in their little life and um yeah i like books like that that are slow but i, I mean i also like action-packed books but i also like um super slow books so if you don't like really slow books and you need a lot of like action and things constantly like bam 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 i'm not sure if you like this there are constantly things happening but it's not written in a way that's very thrilling it's more like kind of I wonder I think she maybe she's doing it on purpose kind of like sleepy like that's how I think of it. it's kind of just like this like this is what I imagine <laughs> but yeah so I think that's gonna be the end of this vlog I hope you guys enjoyed it I plan on to continue doing weekend reading vlogs it was really fun I mean this weekend I had I like did a bunch of things not every weekend is like this obviously but um yeah I hope you guys enjoyed it let me know if you liked it definitely give it a thumbs up um let me know if you have read this book or if you're curious to pick it up and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!